What's up Fit Gamers? Joey B slash 3 here and in this video we're going to be taking a look at an awesome cutscene from the game Shenmue. This game is based heavily on martial arts and these two characters have been training their whole lives. So let's see what martial arts techniques they use in this really cool cutscene. All right, so you've seen there from the cutscene and the reenactment we did, these characters are pretty much matched in their moves. So you see there how they first start off in a fighting stance. Ryo is basically in a, a side stance there, and then Guizong is basically almost in a Wing Chun stance. He's kind of squared up and forward with his fists uh, out in front of him. So the first exchange that they have here is two roundhouse kicks. They each throw a roundhouse kick. So Ryo, he throws his roundhouse kick, straight to the midsection, and then Guizong does the same thing to the other side. Now what they do is they counter each other by blocking with their hands. Both kicks are headed to hit the midsection of the opponent, so they both throw the roundhouse and then block at the same time with their hands. Right after that first exchange, they throw the kick, and then right away they both throw a back fist and meet each other forearm to forearm. Once their back fists have met there on center line, Ryo goes for a midline punch straight to the midsection of Guizong. All Guizong does is counter by bringing his arm down and deflecting that strike from Ryo with his forearm. He deflects it away from his midsection and gets it right off of center line. After Guizong uses that deflection, now their arms are connected. And Ryo from here is basically gonna just strike Guizong's forearm up with an uppercut motion and Guizong is gonna circle his hands out to make sure that connection is broken. Once their connection is broken, Ryo throws a left hook right to Guizong's head. Guizong simply evades that strike by ducking and turning and he gives Ryo a spinning heel hook kick. Bam, straight across the jaw. Ryo wasn't expecting that, but he recovers very quickly. He uses the momentum from getting hit, takes a step, turns, and then jumps for a jumping, spinning heel hook kick and lands on the ground. Guizong was definitely not expecting that counter from Ryo and he gets smacked in the face as well. Then they both drop to the ground and the fight is over. As you can see, Shenmue is a very cinematic game. The camera is constantly moving during the cutscenes. It quick cuts to different angles. So sometimes it's hard to find out what is actually going on. What I really liked about the choreography of this cutscene was that these characters are so matched and they also have kind of a traditional uh, martial arts style to each of them. Ryo has the Japanese martial arts and then Guizong has the Chinese martial arts and you see kind of some of their forms come out during their exchanges. For those of you who have not experienced Shenmue, I highly recommend that you pick up the HD remaster that they just released. It's a great way to experience the game and you really see how this game was way ahead of its time in 1999 when it was released. A lot of the gameplay mechanics you see in this game and the cinematic qualities have carried over all the way to modern day games as we know it. All right, so there you have it with this Fit Gamer Fight Move cutscene breakdown straight from Shenmue 1. Rio versus Guizong. If you guys really enjoyed this video, please leave a thumbs up. Share the video with your friends if you think someone might enjoy it. That is one of the biggest ways to help out the channel. And as always, make sure to subscribe so you don't miss any other videos in the future. Hit that little notification bell as well. Thank you so much to the longtime supporters of this channel and anybody new watching. We really hope you guys enjoy the videos and thank you for being patient with me on getting these videos out to you guys. As always guys, game on, stay fit, and keep on training. We'll see you guys in the next one.